excuse me. Shouldn't take too long. Sounds good. I'll wait outside the car. Owen Wilson, remember. No witnesses. Got it. Hey, got the stuff. Let's get moving. Yeah, not so fast. May run into a little problem while you're in there. What do you mean? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Wilson, what the fuck? Listen, I'm sorry. I know it looks bad. You in there for a while. He started jogging by, and then he sat down, and he started staring at me. I thought you were going to come out soon. Mm. I just didn't want him to see us leave, so I brought it upon myself to tie him up and throw him in the back of the car. Right. No witnesses, remember? Mm. Yeah, and you couldn't have waited until he passed to tell me to come outside? You know, I think that would have been a better idea. You think? <sighs> now what the fuck are we supposed to do? Throw him into the ocean? Mm -mm. No, mm -mm. Mm -mm. no, we're not gonna throw him into the ocean. Not yet. Mm -mm. Hey, what should get you done? You got him all riled up again. Me? What I've done? You're the one who thought tying him up and putting him in the back of the trunk was a fucking good idea in the first place. Well, you got me there. How about we take him out of the trunk, we put him in the car with us, we drive around until we figure this whole thing out. Does that sound good? Fine. You grab his legs, I'll grab I'll grab his arms. This is the kind of shit you get us into. I mean you just want to see what I'm saying. Sorry, trying to be gentle. Hi there. So I know what you're thinking. And believe me, this is a pretty sticky situation for all of us. But I do have a proposition. We let you go as long as you promise not to go to the police and pretend like none of this ever happened. What do you say? Fuck you. You really think I'm not gonna go to the police after all the hell you put me through? You tied me up and threw me in the back of the car. Who the fuck does that? All right, I'll admit, lapse of judgment on my part. However, if you promise not to rat on us, 
we'll let you go. He's not gonna budge. Yeah, probably not. Anyways, all this inconveniencing has made me extremely hungry. You want me to drive through somewhere? I mean, sure. We're in no rush. You want something to eat? Come on, I know you're hungry. <sighs> Fine. I guess I could go with some fries. Perfect! All right, Smith, let's go get this man some fries. Beautiful, isn't it? You can say that again. <sighs> Look, it's obvious you guys aren't bad guys. You just got caught in a mix up. And I promise if you let me go, I won't go to the police. I won't do any of that. But I also know you didn't try to hurt me. I mean, even if you did tie me up and throw me in the back of your car. Wilson, what are you doing? Come on, Smith. You heard the guy. He's not gonna go to the police. And he knows that we meant him no harm. I just don't think it's a good idea. Smith, man. seriously, relax. It's fine. For some reason, just trust the guy. All right. I guess it's about time we get out of here. You know, I really think I learned something valuable today. I mean, no matter how bleak life gets, no matter how much the odds seem against you, I... Mother...